I want to know how to mix the spirit, the water, and the blood by Mr. Patrick from the USA. Mr. Patrick, you want to know how to mix the spirit, the water, and the blood, being the witnesses. All right. If you're watching me now and you want to know how to mix the spirit, the water, and the blood, follow the link, my YouTube link up there, somewhere around there. Just follow the link. Follow the instruction. Subscribe to the YouTube channel up. Turn on the notification bell. When we want to go on Zoom, where I will teach people how to mix the witnesses so that they can begin to use it for deliverances for themselves and for churches, they are going to be notified. Note, it is when you subscribe to our YouTube channel, the YouTube link is up, subscribe now to be among the first 100 people that is going to be notified. It's very important, and I will mix it there, use it there, and you will see how I did it. So subscribe to the YouTube channel, turn up the notification bell, the link is up there to know how to mix the spirit, the water, and the blood. Second question, is there a difference between principalities and demons? Antonia from Utopia. Yes, Antonia, there is a big difference between principalities and demons. Principalities are like the police you have in Utopia. So principalities are spiritual legal authorities. They are established by the biblical rule of laws. The reason why we call them principalities is because the Bible calls them principalities. Though the Bible gave them many other names, like the pestilence in the Old Testament that came to kill the firstborns of Egypt. We have the locust, we have the horn, we have many of them. We have the canker worm, we have too many of them. Any spirit that attacks you on the instruction of God Almighty, that spirit is not a demon, but a principality. For instance, the serpent also is a principality. So they have many names. But demon spirits are not legal. Demon spirits are not legal beings. So demon spirits can be cast out. That is why Jesus said to us, In my name you shall cast out devils. Alright? So when you use the name Jesus, the devil will go. How will you quickly notice that what you're casting is either demons or principality? The truth is that if it is demon, when you say in the name of Jesus, it will just go. But if that thing you are casting refuse to go, know that it's not a demon, it's a principality. Because demons will not hear the name of Jesus twice. They will hear it once and check out. But principalities will say, Amen, when you mention the name of Jesus. Because Jesus is their head. So, they are, and you should understand that they could be falling, some of them are falling angels. But we must understand that they are both Positive and negative. We have positive principalities like angels like Angel Gabriel are all principalities. Angel Michael is principalities. Angel Michael is principalities. So we have all the principalities. We also have negative principalities like the serpent. And God most times use both the positive principalities and the negative principalities to attack the people. This one say, why are you teaching about principalities when Jesus said we are far above principality? Alice from UK. Listen, go back to that scripture. The Bible never said you are far above principalities. He was referring to Jesus. Jesus became far above principalities when he had lost his physical body. Rather, the Bible says in Titus 3 and verse 1, it said, put them in mind to be subject to principalities, to obey magistrates. So, you are to be subject to principalities. Principalities are like the police of the land. Subject, you are to be subject to them. Not that you are worshipping them. No, because they will only attack you if you have gone against what God said you should not do. If you have gone against the scripture, they are going to attack you. Why need to pay money? In order to deal with principality, if I'm living in Germany, <laughs> if I'm living in Germany, we don't charge you money to pay for principality. But then, that doesn't mean I'm going to use my money to get the witnesses for you. I don't produce the witnesses. We buy those witnesses. So, we buy those witnesses from the shops. So, we will pay to get the witnesses that we'll use. And you must clear your mind. I don't do what other pastors do. Because, oh, you are... You are, you are paying for the service. Nobody is paying for service. What you do is you get what we will use. Those witnesses that we will use, you will get it. We will get it for you and we pay for it. So please, something is free. Always find out why is it free. That's why most times you people have been praying, praying, doing everything because you are looking for free thing. And that is why you are not having uh, that result. They will pray for you. They, are, they will not see result. Why? You always quote the scripture for them. Freely you have received. Freely give. Please, what I'm giving to you now is free. The knowledge I'm imparting into you is free. But if you are interested to deal with it, I'm not going to use my money also to go and buy those things that we are going to use to deal with it. You will provide the money for that. And that is what I'm telling you. So, uh, if I, you will buy what we will use for the witnesses. It's not a hidden thing. All right? As a pastor, if I want to be using the witnesses in my church to deal with principality so that people will be vomiting, fib fibroid, and... <laughs> Listen. 
are you trying to be using it because you want people to vomit and fiber come out of people or you just want to save so most times you want to see results so that people will say you are powerful that's why you are on this but in any case still i'm going to teach you as a pastor and show you how you're going to do it and then you'll get to me the same thing that happened in our ministry how people are vomiting how people are passing out their two blockade five broad people are getting married such thing will still happen in your ministry so get in touch with us we are going to make it available for you my name is godswill abbey and i am the principality specialist god bless you and bye